the book Hiding Out at the Pancake Palace. And today I got to speak to a whole bunch of 4th, 5th, and 6th graders about writing, about secrets, and about the Pinelands. I was watching America's Got Talent one day, and I kind of like saw this little kid going up in front of everybody, and I thought, wow, that's really hard to go up in front of like a whole bunch of people and I thought, what happens if, what happens if like somebody freezes up? Any of you ever have stage fright? Yeah. Yeah, you know, yeah. you know that speaking in public is the number two fear of all Americans? Did you know that? Yeah. Number one is fear of computers. <laughs> Have any of you really kept trying and working at something and kept getting rejected and kept on? Yeah, okay. So here's what I did, and I want you all to do this because this is really important. I do something called a rocking chair test, okay? And we're all going to do it now. Everybody in this room, okay? Okay, except, are you sure you don't want to do No, 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 I'm just writing a book. I'm just writing a book. So that was all my research that I kind of did. Okay? And then, oh my God, I realized that this is a book that's about secrets. The children who came to the party lived in the barrier islands. Their schools and most likely their homes were damaged by Hurricane Sandy. They are still displaced. After we talked about the book, the fourth, fifth, and sixth graders did crafts and played some book-related games like a pancake book toss and a carnival wheel. They each received a copy of the book donated by Roaring Brook Press, by me, and by the Ocean County Library. It was nice to take a break from rebuilding and recovering from the storm and celebrate and have a party.